here you can see this is the a rather large version of the forest cobra and it's also the one that you just saw in the previous video larger melanoleuca now as you can see it's quite a robust cobra and it's uh, it's they're very strong and they quite fast moving but like all the cobras they have a, a reasonably slow strike this one as you can see just wants to get away you might turn around and come for me but most of the time it's just a warning and they're saying leave me alone I want to go there you can see even with my hand here he's not trying to bite me he's just on his guard this is a particularly large one it's a while since we've captured such a large one and as I said this is the this is the beauty that you saw Sheldon and Patrick dealing with in the previous video just wanted to give you a, a bit of a close-up of this one you can see some detail typical cobra behavior standing up and it's gradually backing off and once it feels it's got far enough then it will just turn around and run now you can also see they stand up pretty high as compared to their body length very majestic and very impressive looking snake and like most cobras they're not fussy in their diet they'll eat other snakes toads frogs rodents um, basically anything that's small enough and anything that can move but make no mistake this is a very deadly snake if this were to bite me now the effects would be just as drastic as with a black mamba bite But to me, I still maintain, with some six or seven years experience of these, this particular species, to me this is one of the least aggressive of the cobras. Okay, did I get too close? Sorry. Well, uh, I'm just going to move away from this now, and let's see if he just goes down and then moves away.